says yes, thank you very much. It was a very healthy nick, very good bit of wicket keeping, and Coulton Isle strikes immediately. Timid shot. Just looking to just to poke it down to third man. And ben Dunk, uh, good catch, had to come forward. It's pretty deep there, but Coulton Isle, he's happy. Down the ground, man will come in and takes it. Well, there are very few bigger wickets in this tournament than Chris Lynn, but Coulton Isle has his man. That's uh, not right out of the middle of the bat and will be easily taken. Glenn Maxwell, the captain, Coulton Isle, is having a night out in Canberra. Swung lustily at his first two deliveries, Wood. Needs to be more watchful oh. and, ah, oh, trouble. Ah, oh, Coulton Isle, you're a magician. Completely turned this game on its head. He's only been there three balls and it's been two shocking calls. Great Philly from Coulton Isle moved to his left. And underarmed into the stumps. Jack Wood's taken every stump out of his dive. <laughs> right down the middle of the pitch. Oh! <laughs> Strike! Might have to send him the invoice for a new stump, Mike. Melbourne Stars. Oh, hello. He's going to get another one. <laughs> Didn't line up that first one. And he, he's just kept him guessing all night with great varieties. Yeah, it's, it's smart bowling. Gilly because he's bowling to a left hander. Always better than the last couple, hasn't he? Catch it's a call and it's taken at cover. Stoinis moved well enough there to take the last wicket. Nathan Cool to Nile. Absolutely outstanding. Fast bowling of the highest order finishes with four for ten.